It's a warning sign that many drivers fail to heed. Hundreds of deer are estimated to be killed on the roads of West Sussex each year. A new survey asks people to voluntarily submit sightings of dead animals on the roads. It's not scientific, but it backs up some motorists' perceptions that there's more so-called roadkill than ever before. There's obviously more cars on the road now, more vans on the road. Um, you know, and it, accidents happen and think these things are going to happen, but yeah, no, I would say, I would say there probably is. In five months, more than 200 animal road deaths were reported in West Sussex. The largest number of casualties were badgers, more than 300 across Britain. There were 200 pheasant deaths and 150 foxes fell victim to traffic. The survey also recorded small numbers of other species such as polecats and rats and more owls were killed than deer according to these figures. It's usually down to council road crews to clear up the bodies which may be a health or safety hazard. Wildlife experts say although the self-reporting survey must be treated with caution, the figures are a useful indicator of the strengths of various animal numbers in an area. And it actually gives us quite good quantitative information about what's common and what is not common anymore. So we're seeing a lot of badgers uh, dead on the road, unfortunately, and that indicates their population is quite strong. We have a good population of badgers in Sussex. Whereas years ago, we used to see lots of squashed hedgehogs. Now we don't see so many. Uh, it shows that the hedgehog population is really under threat. The project hopes to make recommendations to make the roads safer for wildlife. Sean Killick, BBC South Today.